Hey everybody, Nova here, and I have a very special surprise for you guys today. I went out and bought Mass Effect Legendary Edition. So, starting now, I will be having uh, playthroughs constantly of Mass Effect 1 through 3. All of them, all the DLCs and everything. If I'm correct, they're all in it's all here, all included in Mass Effect. And you know what? I'm fucking hyped. I am ready to go on this adventure with you guys. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Go Welcome ahead, to started. Alliance Military Database. Classified information requested. <sighs> Give it to me. I want all Establishing the info. secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. John Shepard or Jane Shepard? Yeah, we're obviously gonna go with John Shepard. Please log in to access your profile. Profile reconstruction we'll complete. We'll just go with John Shepard. Commander Shepard. Yeah, I, I think that's okay. Identification confirmed. Uh, we're gonna go with veteran. We're no pussy. Yeah, veterans. The middle ground, it would seem. Oh, yeah, here we go. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets, learned to look out for himself. He saw his whole unit die on a cruise. He could have some serious emotional scars. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? Hell yeah. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. That ass. In the year 2048, or 2148, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization. In the decades that followed, these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies enabling travel. Travel. Oh damn, there's just not enough time. Fuck, I had to be a speed reader. Y'all can pause it though. You'll be alright. I, on the other hand, cannot. The Arcturus Prime relay is in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot. God damn that ass. Fuck. All stations secure for transit. Double cheap, double on Thursday. Board is green. Approach run has begun. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Everyone hates that guy. Minus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. 
Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. You Here always expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing here? Joker! Status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth system's engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Eden Better Prime. brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Oh. I heard I'm on my way. <laughs> is it me, or does the Captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Alrighty. For another time, let's just get to it. No, so I just saw him. Mark's pilot. I grew up on Eden Prime, dog. Right, it's not well, the kind of place Spectre's visit. What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real action. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Uh, you need to calm down, Corporal. A good soldier stays cool, even under fire. Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before, not one with a Spectre on board. Just treat this like every other assignment you've had and everything will work out. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself on a coos. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do something stupid to mess it up. Don't worry, sir. I'm not gonna screw this up. All right. The captain's waiting for me. Goodbye, Commander. Yeah, I should stop talking and get moving. Hello, Nihilus. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Yeah. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? What's your point? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. That's obvious. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. What's the payload, Captain? A research team on Eden Prime. Unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the Citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime Dogs, doesn't have yeah. the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. <clears throat> the Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. God, the, we the want more say with the Citadel Council. So much the Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. 
Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we seek. I don't care that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Where Just give the go? word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden Prime. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! Ash, we got a I mean, uh, great personnel. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties! I repeat, heavy casualties! We can't! They came out of nowhere. We need. With laser beams, that's a great combination. Everything cuts out after that. No comm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Status report. The tenth. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Boy, oh boy. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. Roger what about that, survivors, sir? Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. <laughs> Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. We've got his back, Captain. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! Yeah, we are approaching from point two. Yeah, it's... It's been years since I played this, so I have no remembrance. Ship perimeter secure, Commander. Can I jump? Oh, shit. So, RT sign. God damn, the accuracy is horrible. Okay. That works a lot better. Get down! Oh shit. Alright, so X is the throw grenades. B is to melee. Uh, okay, so I can make everybody equip certain weapons. Hold the machine gun now. Oh, what's this? Upgrade kit. Heart weave sounds better. Well, I'm glad I went this way first. Alright, so we can run by holding A down. Oh god. What happened here? Seems like there's a war still going on.
He's up close. Oh, he's dead. Okay, never mind. Man, those things are actually pretty fucking weak. Uh, you dead? Yep, he's dead. Right through shields. Fuck. I a chance. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Yeah. Aye, aye, sir. can bypass the decryption and electronic sounds. Damn. Okay, why? Healed since okay. Alright, I've got some buildings here, Shepard. That's good. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Alright, so issues uh, or command issues. Alright, so. Have him stay behind. Alright, this is nice. I like this. Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Are you wounded, Williams? A few yeah, scrapes and burns. Good. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. You're we tried to get off the distress call, roasted, but they cut dude. off our communications. Bodies everywhere. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Fighting these things. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the, the vale in two months. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. What is investigate? Uh... <laughs> okay. Move out. Alright. Yeah, I like the white and red. Uh, let's see. I saw it creates. Oh. The beacons at the far end of this trench. Ammo upgrade, anti personnel rounds. Uh, I will take this. Armor. Uh, that's not what I meant. Oh, okay. Now I'm camoed out. Fuck yeah.
Oh, that's going to be fucking fun. God damn. <laughs> Wait, didn't I tell him to swap? Yeah, use your fucking lancer, not your pistol. Can we... Oh, never mind, the bodies are gone. Check them out for the loot. No fucking... Well... Alright, what's in here? Pistol, shotgun, sniper... Everything but a... Oh yeah, I forgot we only get to pick one. This Shit. is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Boy. Our side or the gas? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think Shit. anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. They probably fucking did. Change of plan, Shepard. Look, there's a small spikes. spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Alrighty. Looks like they hit the camp hard. Yeah, I think everyone's it's a good place yep, for an ambush. Keep your guard up. God damn. Oh fuck, what happened to them? Oh god, they're still alive! What did the Geth do to them? Turn it into something we want to fucking get. Uh, I think I might want a shotgun for this. Security locks engaged. Uh, right. Get manual override. Wait, I'm confused. Wait. Uh. Ah, uh, really? Well, I fucking s fucked that up. Oh wait, there's people in there. What the hell? Hello? Oh. oh. Reduced to Omni Gel. Uh, reduced to Omni Gel. I'll take that, it's armor. Alright, so now can we try it again? Nope. Uh, maybe... Can I reduce stuff to Omni Gel in my inventory? And if we mess up, we're gonna do it again. So I can just override it. Oh, I get it. Damn, that's what, it's, what am I talking about? Humans, thank the maker. Fuck. Okay. Hurry, close the door before they come back. God, you're don't worry, we'll protect you. We'll thank protect you. I think we'll be citizen. okay now. It looks like everyone's okay. gone. You're Doctor Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack Bad came, decision. the Marines <laughs> held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, <laughs> only ruin and corpses will remain. Uh, what else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment. The next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers. Bringers of darkness. 
heralds of our extinction. Just we could hear the battle outside, <laughs> gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. Bottom. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Uh, Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. I know what I can kick in. That'll make him feel a lot better. My fucking boot. Oh. Cutscene. Oh. There's others of his species. Sarah. Uh oh. Lilas. Something tells me this isn't gonna be good. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh, fuck. Well, some tells me he just got fucking what is sh what wasted. Is oh, fuck. That looks giant. Are they gone? Uh, it's a... You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. It's like we owe you our lives. Uh, yes. I still can't believe yeah. it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. Knew it was trouble Probably the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. Uh, beacon. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. I have to go. Hey, Cole, okay. we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys go. are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, the stuff? Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. You should come with me. You have something to tell me, Cole? Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. Smuggling's a crime. You're breaking the law, Cole. We're not hurting anybody. Hell, most of the time I don't even know what's in the packages. I just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. Uh... We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? <laughs> yeah, there's one more thing. 
I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Good karma. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. I have to go. Good luck. So... Oh, weapon upgrade, too. Yeah. Do us... Give us, like, bad karma. You know. <sighs> we'll see. We'll see. Right now, we kind of are one to one. Commander. Uh, hold on. I want this medical kit first. Damn, he fucking did. A Turian? You know him? Did. He's a Spectre. He was with us all morning. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't! Don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry, I was Straight hiding. Up. You almost got creatures. blasted. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Other? What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Then what? Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. He <laughs> was fucking was sad trouble. as hell. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Alright. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Yeah, but let's stop Take talking. the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. God damn, he's got weak emotions. Got anything hiding around here? Upgrade kit, I'll take it. Grenade, high explosive? Ooh, no, don't do that. Hold on, poppy. I want that. Fucking high explosive. I'll fucking take that any day. Chemical rounds. Yeah, I'll take that. Alrighty. Hell yeah. Is there enemies here? Oh yeah. Hold on. Ha 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 yes. Oh, that's fucking beautiful. Oh, wait, there's more. Uh. Get fucking blasted, boy. Oh man, I thought there would be something. I'm just a greedy goblin, dude. Uh, is he under? Wait, what? I saw his name tag come up for a second. Is he on the roof? Maybe. I don't know. He's shooting at us. Alright. So now I know how to use powers.
damn, did that bomb? You're about to get shot in the back. Like Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Fuck, man. He's a wild man. Hopefully we get here soon. Oh, fuck. Uh, I don't know what's happening there. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. Uh. All right. No time to fight. Gotta be a hero. My people will cover me. I have faith. This is amazing. Actual working uh, technology. Unbelievable. Watch him die. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. 
Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Don't touch it. Don't get close. Grab her. Get the fuck out of the way. Shepard! No, don't oh, touch me! Oh. Command's not going to be too happy about that, just saying. God damn. We identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime. The Normandy. A human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And really? the beacon commander. One of the humans may have used it. God damn, dude. Take a chill from fucking Kylo Ren over here. Now make out. This human must be eliminated. She was like, man, that was intense. Fuck, man. She fucking wants some. You fucking see her titch hanging halfway out. Gosh, damn. Doctor. Dr. Chakwas. I think he's waking up. Doctor what? Chakwas? Is that like a type of shoe? You had us worried there, Ken. Chakwas. Okay. How are you feeling? Uh, dude. I feel... Minor throbbing. Nothing serious. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. Actually, I'm gonna fuck you. You had no way to know what would happen. Actually, we don't <laughs> even know so if that's kind. what set it off. <laughs> Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. I appreciate it. Physically, <laughs> you're fine. But I detected oh, some thanks, unusual Commander. brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. You make me feel I also really noticed good an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. Uh, a vision. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may... Oh. Captain Anderson. How's our XO holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the command is going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Uh... I'm fine. I'll live. I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Gether uh, invaded. Saren. The Council's going to want answers. I didn't do anything wrong, Captain. Hopefully the Council can see that. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. Uh, obviously. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's no dangerous. shit. And he hates humans. He, wanted he didn't come to Eden Prime because he hates humans. You're right. Saren has allied himself with the Gith. I don't know how. I don't know why, but it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? 
Any clue that might tell us what Sarah Death was after? And destruction, that's what I saw. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? A warning. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. What are we gonna tell him? I had a bad dream? It's a good question. We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation, his politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. You're right. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the Council on our side. We expose him. We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the Council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the Ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. I mean, it's... We should they want to talk close. to us anyway, so... Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Alrighty. Well, well, well. Hey, Ashley. <laughs> I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Fuck, he'll be missed. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. What? That's not true. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. I appreciate that. Are you Things okay? were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. Comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out, and you never get I've used to seeing dead before. civilians. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up. You helped. We couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. Glad I think you're gonna fit in here just fine, Williams. Thanks, Commander. <laughs> Ashley. Joker's waiting for you in the bridge, Commander. God damn it, Ashley. You know, pun. I'm gonna fucking go cry. What's up here? Door control. Oh, it's a bitch. Huh? Okay. Uh, Joker. What's going on? Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. <laughs> Even in the future, taxes exist. I wonder what space taxes are like. Probably ungodly. You had to pay for our military ships. Boy, that's a big ass citadel. What was I supposed to do? Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension. Flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. <laughs> Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. I'm sure that thing's Look got at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower, Normandy out. They just say, Normandy, no, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to dock 422. Fucking main ship just blasts her ass out of existence. You killed our operative. Couldn't be Saren, you're crazy. What is the fucking ship, bro? That little quick loading. This is an outrage! 
The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? That's true. The Turians Racism. don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Wow, what a bunch of Captain dudes. Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Oh, Seren's a threat to every human colony out there. If they don't stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission or... on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I specter, want to go over a few things like before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. <laughs> Fucking politicians. I'm sorry for something. Boss. The pulsing arrow on your radar. So how do I get there, though? Top level, let's just go down. What's welcome that thing? to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Okay. Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. So are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence. Programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. I'll no, pass. I'm just going to the elevator. I, I think apologize I'll pass. if you found my service unsatisfactory. Nah. Please submit any complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Wait, Have a nice is day. This the... uh, Citadel Tower. Alrighty. Well, guys, I'm going to have to end it here. On the next episode, we will climb the Citadel Tower and see if they're going to hold Saren accountable for his actions. I'm excited to continue this series, so tune in for the next episode. It won't be too long. Should, shouldn't be. I think I'm going to play this quite often, so... Definitely keep tuned and keep your eyes peeled. But thanks for tuning in on this episode.